Hey guys, welcome back to our channel Cat Solution. Today we will learn about the exploded view using Creo software. First of all, understand what is exactly is an exploded view. In simple terms, it's a 3D representation where components of assembly are separated or exploded. Showcasing how they fit together, this technique is crucial for understanding complex assemblies, making it easier to communicate to your ideas to client or anyone else who needs to see how it all comes together. Let's create exploded view in Creo. First, select the working directory. I had created separate folder on desktop. Wherever you want, you can select that folder. Now open the assembly. Select server assemblies. So only server assemblies can be shown here. Click preview. Open. So the gearbox assembly is open now. If you want to rotate the assembly, press middle mouse button and using mouse you can rotate the assembly. If you want to drag, press shift middle mouse button and using mouse you can drag it here and there. We have reference drawing for the exploded view of the gearbox. So we will create exactly same exploded view. First of all, set the view orientation of the assembly. So as of now, I am going with the standard orientation. If you want to change the orientation, you can go to view manager. Go to orient, define new view. I will mention orient here. Press enter. And if you want to set the model in this direction, then just simply set the model accordingly or you can take the plane also and set the assembly normal to that plane after reorientation of the assembly simply right click on the view and click save option ok so in this way you can set the orientation of the assemblies but as of now I am going with the standard orientation only let's start with this top lid and its bolts we have a default exploded view also available here if you can click on this exploded view button you can get the default exploded view but i don't want in this way i will create my own go to the view manager go to export tab take new exploded view and define any name to the view I will define explode, press enter and now go to the edit position, select top cover along with it bolt so it will be easy to manage both accordingly. Using arrow you can move this assembly up and down, press control and unselect this top cover and just slightly move that bolts upside click ok and if you want to save this view then you can go to the view manager again right click on the view name and click save so in this way you can save the view many components at a time go to edit position press ctrl to select more parts and you can slide accordingly as per your requirement You can again select the orientation from here. Either you can select the part from here or you can select from the model tree also.
select the entire assembly so it will be easy to manage Try to save the view in between. If Creo crashes or if you by mistakenly close the window, then it will not be saved. Your work will be lost that you have done. So try to save in between while working. You can hide the some parts from here so that the remaining parts which are behind the model that you can select without changing the orientation. Press Ctrl to unselect parts. Unhide part from model tree.
Suppose if you want to move this housing cover back to its original position, then instead of moving it manually, we have different option available. Go to edit position, then option and copy position. Here select the components to move. I want to move this housing cover and copy position from select the components for the same. I want I want to move that housing cover with respect to this housing. So I will select it from here and simply click apply. The cover will get back to its original position. Our accurate view is now created. Save the view. Now take a new drawing. I will use same name as the model. So take this checkbox. Select empty. If you want to select redefine format, you can select it from here or you can select empty also. And later on, if you have any templates, then you can add it from there. From here, you can change the sheet size. Double click on size. From here, you can browse your sheet. Take a view. View display. No hidden. Keep it solid, apply, go to view state, tick this checkbox, explode component in view and select the exploded view, we have named the view explode, apply, change the scale as per your requirement, if it is not fitting you can change the scale or you can change sheet as well. and take this option to move the view block the view movement so this is how our explorer view is created in creo software next video we will learn about the bomb creation in the creo along with the auto ballooning that's it for today if you find this video helpful give it a thumbs up subscribe for more videos and drop a comment below with your thoughts or any questions you have until then keep designing keep creating see you in the next video